welcome back to my channel. Um, face reveal, this is what I look like. Basically today I'll be explaining what the Raven shifting method is and... Holy shit, I thought I heard something. <laughs> I thought I heard something. But if you hear a noise in the background, that's my little brother. He's watching YouTube on my aunt's phone. I, is that Robin's phone? Is that Robin's phone? Whatever. Um, also, just a little like... Um, Forewarning, I swear quite a lot, so if you're not comfortable with that, and if your parents aren't comfortable with that, click off, because I don't want you getting in trouble for listening to explicit videos. <laughs> or watching explicit videos, or whatever. Or watch with headphones. That's definitely a good idea. But, um, I'll be explaining the raven shifting method, I believe I said. I'm very stupid, so I forget stuff very quickly. Um, I don't know who created this method, whoever created this method, or created shifting in general, kudos to you. If you have no idea what shifting is, basically, you're shifting your conscious mind, or subconscious mind, or whatever, to another reality. Um, which you do by doing daily, by making daily decisions. Like, for example, if you did click on this video, there's a reality where you didn't. If you didn't click on this video, there's a reality where you did. So, yeah, it's it's definitely weird and confusing, but at the same time, it's really, really cool because you don't just, like, shift your by making small decisions. You could actually shift to a completely different reality and, like, trick your mind into believing that you're there and then you're actually there, and it's really cool. My parents and, like, my family doesn't really like it because they think it's bad and, like, it's going to make you stupid, but it's not, so I do it behind their back anyways because I do what I want. <laughs> but, um... So that's shifting. I'm trying to shift to Hogwarts at the moment, and it's not going all that good. I have yet to shift, unfortunately, but I have just a little bit of experience because I learned like I've learned a lot of the methods and like a lot of the subliminal channels on YouTube and whatnot, and like some do's and don'ts, I guess. But I'm just explaining the Raven method. If you guys want me to do like um, a whole other video where I explain shifting and whatnot, then comment down below and like this video. Also today going up, I'll be giving off a few fun facts about myself, just so you can get to know me, because I usually post editing videos, but I'm changing my channel a little bit. Um, so basically the Raven Method. It is recommended that you listen to a subliminal when doing this, so for me, I listen to a Hogwarts subliminal, and um, I believe I like love good subliminals, I think they're really good I, on YouTube, they're really good. Um, but basically, so you lay in a starfish position, so none of your limbs are touching, and then you begin slowly counting to 100. Within every five, like, after you count up to five, or like ten, so like, by counting by fives, like five, ten, fifteen, but of course count by ones. So basically, to give you an example, if I'm being confusing, which I know I am, you go one, two, three, four, five, um, of course you don't count that fast, and then you say like an affirmation, like, I am shifting to blah blah blah, my DR, my desired reality. And um, then after a while, your mind eventually starts to believe that you are shifting and like, oh my god, like, duh, that's where I should be. And then after 50, usually when I've, fin when I've reached 50, I start saying stuff like I have shifted to my desired Hogwarts reality. So that way I can really trick my mind into believing it. Excuse me, so sorry. And if you see me looking up, we're watching Divergent on TV, but I have it muted, so that way it doesn't make any more background noise. But basically, so you listen, lay on your back, on your bed, um, starfish position, you count two sub, you count, I'm so freaking stupid. You count from zero to, you don't say zero, you say one, and you then, you count from there, count to 100, and you say sub, I swear to God, if I mess up one more time, you say affirmations in between counting, and then eventually your mind... Sorry, that dude's from Footloose, I just recognized him, the 2011 remake. But, um, and then you say affirmations in between, and eventually your mind starts to believe, oh yeah, I'm at Hogwarts. I know, it's really weird, you can trick your mind to <laughs> into thinking that, or wherever you're trying to go, I'm going to try I'm trying to go to Hogwarts. I believe my little brother would like to go to the Percy Jackson realm, he, or realm, or reality, or whatever the hell it's called, but <laughs> that's what we were talking about the other day, he said he would go to Percy Jackson, if he could. So that's pretty cool, but, um, yeah, 
So that's basically the Raven method. And if I accidentally start talking with a Southern accent, that is because my family is from Arkansas. So they all have like really, really strong Southern accents. So that's where it comes from. So please don't hate on me. <laughs> so that's what happens. Um, but yeah, that's the Raven method. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.